Okay guys, here we are again, day 26 of Hellfast. One week to go. And this is what I'm reviewing today. New Quorn Jerk Mini Fillets. Now, I did go to Tesco's today. I had two like products in mind because I've done so much corn over this Hellfast. And they didn't have them. They didn't have hardly anything, but they had a whole load of new corn stuff. And I just got two more um, food reviews to film before the end of Hellfast. And then I can get back to doing my usual stuff. Um, so I bought this and I also bought another one because I got a deal, but we'll come to that in a minute. So this is New Corn Jerk Mini Fillets, high in protein, high in fiber, vegan, ready to eat. Um, there's your traffic light system. And there's a, QR code there, whatever that is. Um, 138 grams. Corn products are a source of protein because they contain mycoprotein, a nutritious and sustainable protein source made in a lab. Mycoprotein is footprinted by the Carbon Trust and has less impact on our planet's resources. Right, um, ingredients. So bold, we have got wheat and wheat. Um, vegan savoury flavour mini fillets made with mycoprotein in a jerk style marinade. Uh, right, how many calories? 122 calories per 100 grams. Right, I will hold that as steady as I can for those who are interested in all the nutritionals. There we are. Right, now, so as I say, this is day 26 of Hellfast and I've got a meal prepared right here and here for me to get stuck into this right now. No cooking involved. So I've just, all I'm having with it, I've got some cheese and eggs and just chopped up salady bits with some cheese in here as well. So what I've got in there is just cucumber, tomato, onion and cheese. Yeah, that's all what's in there. Right. Price. we never done the price. Now, price. 138 grams, three quid, three pound for that. That's expensive, isn't it? I'm gonna have the whole lot. I've worked it out, I've calculated all my allowances and I'm gonna have the whole lot of this, getting sick of salad. So, um, yeah, three pound, but I got a deal. You, uh, it was three pound, or you could pick any two items for three pound fifty. Well, that's no brainer, innit? So I picked the second item up. So and I think that was priced at three pound as well. So 175, which is more like it. If you can pick it up for that price, that's a deal. Right, let's have a drink. Okay, let's get this open. No peel and seal, I don't think. Definitely not seal. Well, I must say, I rev last time out, I reviewed a ham, not a corn product, a, a, a ham. I think that was a smoked ham. That smelled a bit like that. 
Now that's what I want to say and in that review I did say that that ham tasted like luncheon meat. I think I was getting confused because I had the, the second half of that ham in last night's meal and I don't think it was luncheon meat what it reminded me. I think it was spam. I, I ain't had luncheon meat or spam since I was a kid I don't think but I think it was spam it tasted like. And that's what this smell like. It's got a similar smell. So there we are. There's your jerk mini fillet. They don't mention chicken, but that is what it's trying to mimic, isn't it? Right, let's give it a go, boo boo. I mean, it's your typical, I've never had corn cold before, to be fair, apart from the slices. It's got a, I mean, chicken sort of break up stringy, don't it? That don't. Um, there's flavour there. It's very slightly got a chicken type texture, but it's very soft, look. It's very squishy. But what I don't get right, there's a bit of flavour there. This is a golden opportunity where I haven't got to simulate something. You know, i.e. the sauce, they can put the same sauce on, they'd put on jerk chicken. There's very little flavour there. No kick. To be honest, I don't think I ever had jerk chicken. I don't think I have. But, from what I've seen of it, it's supposed to have a bit of a kick in it. That's got hardly anything. Let's have a bit of this. Um, that flavouring needs to be about four times stronger then they'd have a decent product there's five bits in there I just ate two just like that I mean, it's, it's decent, but three pound, wow, that's way too much for that. It's worth a go. I mean, vegan, Matt, if you're watching, mate, give it a go. Especially if you can get it with a deal. Let me know what you think of it, mate. It's, it's not, it's just a price. If it was priced at 175 all the time, I would definitely buy it again. But with it being three pound, if, you, if I couldn't get a deal on it, I wouldn't touch it with a barge pole. So for that reason, I'm gonna score it a seven. I'll give it a seven. If they was to really put some real powerful flavoring on that, I think I would have given it late 7.7, 7.8, something like that, if I add more flavour. But even if I add the flavour, I wouldn't pay £3 for it. Right, 
so that that won't get it up on the chicken scoreboard so there we are guys so yeah like i say we're getting close now today the filming is friday so this time next week i will be doing a pizza review breaking this 32 day 32 full days full days of fasting um next friday which will be the way out day day 33 that'll be way out day first thing in the morning probably about 6 a.m i'm hoping to get that filmed edited and out by 10 a.m the way out video and then later on in the day i will actually break the fast with a pizza review which is this time next week so can't wait i absolutely can't wait so there we are booby i think that's it isn't it my man so uh there we go guys thanks for watching and i hope you'll join me again soon on another video take care guys right booby yes you know what time it is it's time booby gets a snack poor old bobby very well he's not been very well today so he ain't eating anything today. Never mind, Boo Boo. Maybe you'll have to have an extra one for Bob. Hey, what about that? Three, four.